Okay. Now's better than later. Got it. Get in. Hold on. Okay. Yeah. Insufficient skill. Okay, obviously we go up. Oh, I sense a boss fight. <laughs> yeah, that's a boss fight. You get a drink of water. Oh, I remember you from Mass Effect. You're an ogre. Twisted creatures! Okay, I did figure out the flaming weapons thing. Excellent. So yeah, that works. I'm wounded. Do something about here. it. Hi, Alistair. How you doing? Signal. Let's light it quickly before it's too late. We'll take all of this. Howard's Aegis. I have no idea what that means. But let's assume that everybody else is also injured and do something about it. Ah, my incident alarm. Okay, I'll turn that off real quick. NPC mage gets a health pol poultice. Um, Alright, where is... Where is the... Uh, the signal. Where do I go? I think I came down from that. Is this it? Oh, the beacon. Yeah. The beacon is lit. Gondor calls for aid. Sound. The retreat. But what about the king? You ass back as bastard. I, command. I I knew this guy was shifty as shit. Holy. I knew. I knew it. Just look at him. He's got villain, you know, villain set Get all out. over himself. All of you, let's move. Sound the retreat. You bitch. Oh my god. Right, and all these guys are going to die. Duncan's going to die. The king's going to die.
Hey, I just killed one of these guys. They are not unbeatable. Well, unless they do that to you. He's climbing that guy like he's a... Oh, wow. Okay, so the king's dead. Logan betrayed the king. Logan's gonna proclaim himself king now, I can tell. Duncan about to eat it. Yeah, the beacons were lit. And so much for Duncan. Okay, so. Did, did I just die? Wait, did, did, did I just die? In a cutscene? The hell? Ah, your eyes finally open. Mother shall be pleased. Uh, what happened to the dark spawn? I remember you, the girl from the wilds. Yes, where am I? Uh, what happened to the dark spawn? You were injured, and then Mother rescued you. Do you not remember? Uh, what happened to the army, to the king? I remember being overwhelmed by dark spawn. She rescued me and me from the tower. Um, I remember being overwhelmed by Darkspawn. Mother managed to save you and your friend, though t'was a close call. How about my dog? What is important is that you both live. Did my the dog man live? who was to respond to your signal quit the field. The Darkspawn won your battle. Those he abandoned were massacred. Your friend, he is not taking it well. Uh, what happened to the Grey Wardens and the King? Neither am I. This is horrible. I need to get out of here. All dead. Your friend has veered between denial and grief since Mother told him. He is outside by the fire. Mother asked to see you when you awoke. Um, why does your mother want to see me? Were my injuries severe? I have some questions if you don't mind. Thank you for helping me. Uh, why does your mother want to see me? I do not know. She rarely tells me her plans. Okay, were my injuries severe? Yes, but I expect you shall be fine. The Darkspawn did nothing Mother could not heal. Adjusting my headset. Sorry, one one second, guys. All right, I have some questions. If you I don't do not mind. mind. Take your time. Um, are we safe here? We are, are safe spot? for the moment. Mother's magic keeps the darkspawn away. Once you leave, tis uncertain what will happen. The horde has moved on, so you might avoid it. Why'd your mother save us? I wonder at that myself. But she tells me nothing. Perhaps you were the only ones she could reach. Okay. I would have rescued your king. A king would be worth a much higher ransom than you. <laughs> I happen to be nobility, you I know. I stand corrected. Uh, how did she manage to rescue us exactly? She turned into a giant bird and plucked the two of you from atop the tower, one in each talon. If you do not believe that tale, then I suggest you ask Mother yourself. She may even tell you. Okay. Are there any survivors besides Only us? Only stragglers that are long gone. You would not want to see what is happening in that valley now. Okay, um, why what's happening? Are you sure you want me to describe it? Yes, please. I wouldn't have asked if, if I hadn't. Um, yeah. I had a good view of the battlefield. It is a grisly scene. There are bodies everywhere and darkspawn swarm them, feeding, I think. They also look for survivors and drag them back down beneath the ground. I cannot say why. Why did Tyrion Loghain abandon the king? I do not know who this Loghain even is. Perhaps ask Mother of it. All right. I think I've asked enough questions. I agree. Tis time you speak with Mother. 
then be on your way. All right, codex updated. Um, so Catherine, uh, Catherine became the Logan's hard way while the poor family was doing the work on the farm. She saw a man on horseback being attacked by several bandits. Okay. Alistair I've already talked to. Dog meat. Duncan. Duncan's dead now. He was killed in battle. Earl Rindon Howe. Okay. Logan McTeer. He fled the field. Yeah, he's a he's a betraying bastard. Morgan. Morgan, I'm not sure I trust, but you know what? Claudia Black has a sexy voice. Okay, win. Quest completed. Achievement un un unlocked. Resilient. Okay. These are all the completed quests. What do I got for actives? None. Okay, I've got no active quests right now. Codex. Okay. Oh look, I'm in my ar uh, my armor. You must speak to mother, then be gone. You have an army of darkspawn to avoid, and it would be best to get an early start. Okay. Um. Thank you for helping I... me, Morgan. You were welcome. Though Mother did most of the work, I am no healer. I will go. Then. I will stay and make something to eat. You know, Morgan's the kind of character that you really should be able to uh, romance no matter what. See, here is your fellow Grey Wharton. You worry too much, young man. You. You're alive. <laughs> I thought you were dead for sure. I'm not thanks to Morgan's mother. Afraid you're going to be left alone. I'm fine. I appreciate your concern. It takes more than a few dollars, Scott. I am fine. I appreciate your concern. Oh, this doesn't seem real. If it weren't for Morgan's mother, we'd be dead on top of that tower. Do not talk about me as if I am not present, lad. I, I didn't mean... But, but what do we call you? You've, ne you've never told us your name. Names are pretty, but useless. The chastened folk call me Flemeth. I suppose Flemeth. it would do. Okay. The Flemeth? From the legends? Daveth was right. You're the Witch of the Wilds, aren't you? And what does that mean? I know a bit of magic, and it has served you both well, has it not? Yep, it has. Who cares who she is? We need uh, to do something now. So why did you save us? If you're Flemeth, you must be very old and powerful. We can't be safe here. We're all the dark spawn. I suppose we should thank you. Must I? Age and power are relative. It depends on who is asking. Compared to you, yes, on both counts. Then why didn't you save Duncan? He is... He was our leader. I am sorry for your Duncan, but your grief must come later. In the dark shadows before you take vengeance, as my mother once said. Duty must come now. It has always been the Grey Warden's duty to unite the lands against the Blight. Or did that change when I wasn't looking? Of course not. It changed when most of them were slaughtered. The Grey Wardens are no more let, let someone else do it. The land is hardly united thanks to Logan. Um, yeah. That doesn't make any sense. Why would he do it? Now that is a good question. Men's hearts hold shadows darker than any tainted creature. Perhaps he believes the Blight is an army he can outmaneuver. Perhaps he does not see that the evil behind it is the true threat. The Archdemon. We'll need to find this Archdemon. What is the Archdemon? Uh, Alistair is the real Grey Warden here. Will you help us fight the Blight? We should contact the rest of the Grey Wardens. What could the Terran hope to gain by betraying the King? The throne? He's the Queen's father. Still... I can't see how he'll get away with murder. You speak as if he would be the first king to gain his throne that way. This is true. Grow up, boy. If Al Eamon knew what he did, he would never stand for it. The Landsmeet would never stand for it. There would be civil war. 
Um, you think the Earl would believe us over to Terran, Earl Eamon, the Earl of Red Cliff. Perhaps we should go to him then. I suppose. Al Eamon wasn't at Ostagar. He still has all his men. And he was Kalen's uncle. I know him. He's a good man, respected in the landsmeet. Of course, we could go to Redcliffe and appeal to him for help. Surely there are other allies we could call on. That sounds like an excellent idea. Keep in mind that Logan was also an honorable man. Everyone will be the, uh, will see the danger the Blight poses and say he doesn't help us with them. Keep in mind that Logan was also an honorable man. The Arl man. would never do what Tan Logan did. I know him too well. I still don't know if Arl Eamon's help would be enough. He can't defeat the Darkspawn Horde by himself. Surely there are other allies. We need the rest of the Grey Wardens. Nothing we can do is there we find a way. Okay, we need the rest of the Grey I don't Wardens. know how to contact them, or, or if they're even on their way. We need to do something now. You have more at your disposal than you think. Of course! The treaties! Grey Wardens can demand aid from dwarves, elves, mages, and other places. They're obligated to help us during a blight. I may be old, but dwarves, elves, mages, this Arl Eamon, and who knows what else. This sounds like an army to me. Yeah. So can we do this? Go to Redcliffe and these other places and build an army? Uh, why not? Isn't that what Grey, Grey Wardens do as long as there's some profit in it? Whoa, let's not get ahead of ourselves. I doubt it will be easy as that. Why not? It's so what you Grey are Wardens set, do. Ready to be Grey Wardens. Uh... As I'll be heavy, I don't suppose you could offer any more help. Yes, thanks for everything, women. Flemeth, sorry, we're going. Now that you mention it, I do have one more thing to offer. The stew is bubbling, mother dear. Shall we have two guests for the eve? Or none? The Grey Wardens are leaving shortly, girl. And you will be joining them. Such a shame. What? You heard me, girl. The last time I looked, you had ears. Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, I think that's an excellent idea. What makes you think we want her? Thank you, but if Morgan doesn't wish, I think that's an excellent have idea. Have I no say in this? No. You have been itching to get out of you the wilds not. for years. Here is your chance. As for you, Wardens, consider this repayment for your lives. Uh, very well, we'll take her with us. Was this your idea all along? She has better be useful as you say. We'll take her with us. Not to look a gift horse in the mouth, but won't this add to our problems? Out of the wilds, she's an apostate. If you do not wish help from us illegal mages, young man, perhaps I should have left you on that tower. Point taken. Mother, this is not how I wanted this. I'm not even ready. You must be ready. Alone, these two must unite Ferelden against the Darkspawn. They need you, Morrigan. Without you, they will surely fail, and all will perish under the Blight. Even I... Yeah, that's bad. I understand. And you, Wardens, do you understand? I give you that which I value above all in this world. I do this because you must succeed. Uh, I understand uh, she won't come to harm with us. But yeah, I understand. Allow me to get my things, if you please. Yeah, go for it. I am at your disposal, Grey Wardens. I suggest a village north of the wilds as our first destination. It is not far, and you will find much you need there. Or, if you prefer, I shall simply be your silent guide. The choice is yours. Um, I think we should get underway. No, I prefer you to speak your mind. I have no problem with your presence. If Alistair doesn't, actually, I have some questions. I prefer you speak your <laughs> mind. You will regret saying that. Dear sweet mother, you are so kind to cast me out like this. How fondly I shall remember this moment. Well, I always said, if you want something done, do it yourself. Or hear about it for a decade or two afterwards. I just... Do you really want to take her along because her mother says so? Well, she's also hot. And Claudia Black voices her. If you worry that I will summon demons and transform into an abomination, I assure you I will at least wait until you are not looking. I feel better already. Okay, I think we should just get underway. Farewell, Mother. Do not forget the stew on the fire. I would hate to return to a burned-down hut. Bah! 
Tis far more likely you will return to see this entire area, along with my hut, swallowed up by the blight. I... all I meant was... Yes, I know. Do try to have fun, dear. <laughs> okay, the Earl of Redcliffe. Uh, Alistair approves, plus four. That's good. I don't, I'm not sure what that means. We can level up all Alistair. Uh, we're going to add two to his constitution and one to his charisma. He's got a specialization. One skill point. Let's see, skills. Stealing, trap making, survival, herbalism. Um, combat tactics. Uh, let's max out combat training for right now. Mm, cleanse area. Threaten. Okay, apparently he doesn't get one of those yet. Does he have... You know what? I'm not... I can't remember. I cannot remember if he is a one-handed fighter or a two-handed fighter. Uh, code updated. Morgan, the Witch of the Wilds. Okay. New screenshot, whatever that means. Morgan approves. This is good. This is good. No level up yet. Spells and talents. She can shape shift into a giant spider. That's interesting winter's grasp lightning lightning's good mind blast that's good okay inventory well let's uh let's put these down here so that i can heal her in combat when necessary all right did the dog level up Dog did not. Okay. Did I level up? I did not. Okay. So. Um. Hold on. Okay, this, it's like, you know, gather your party and venture forth, which means <clears throat> starting into a new area. But uh, this is where we're going to end this session. Um, that was fun. We had a long mass fight up a castle. And then, um, uh, 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 hold on. You have found a gift. You can give it to one of your party members by opening the inventory screen. I, switching to the party member, then right-clicking on the item and selecting gift. Okay, I. Um, what is this gift? Each party member has a favorite type of gift. Certain items are precious. Okay, well, you know what? I will figure that out and come back to it. Um, anyway, as I was saying, uh, this is about it for uh, tonight's session of Dragon Age Origins. Thank you for joining me. If you enjoyed it, uh, you know, please hit that like button. Uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. I had a great deal of fun here. It was one long fight. Action is good. I'm still trying to figure out the controls and how to get the characters to do the things they need to do. Um which is perfectly okay because this is literally the first time I've played and you guys have seen my entire experience with this game. In any case, uh, thank you again for joining me. Be careful out there. The crisis is nearly over, but we're still in it. It is still happening and nobody wants to see anybody else hurt. I certainly don't. So, so take care. Um, you know, make sure that you, uh, you take care of yourself and be kind to one another, please. Please be kind to one another. A small act of kindness can change the world for the better for someone's entire life. 
I know this from personal experience. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.